Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. The intensity at the central maxima O in a young double slit experiment is I naught if the distance OP equals one third of the fringe fringe width of the pattern show that the intensity at point P would be I naught by 4. <laughs> Dear student, here we have to calculate intensity. And intensity can be calculated with phase difference and phase difference can be calculated with path difference. So let us first we have to calculate it with path difference. Okay. And here the diagram is given here the slit S1 and here is the S2 and the distance between the slits S1 and S2 that is D. Okay. And here the point P where the ray reaches to the P and S2 reaches to the P. Okay. And here the central maxima is formed at O. Now, first of all, we have given the distance OP that is YN and it is given in the question this YN is equal to one third of fringe width. Okay. It is given in the question. So, now what is the formula of fringe width? Here the formula of fringe width beta is equal to capital D lambda upon small d. Here capital D is the distance between the slit and the screen and small d that is the distance between the two slits and lambda that is the wavelength. Okay. Now substitute this value in the place of beta. Is it okay? Now transposing this small d and this is capital D transposing to the left side comes in denominator and lambda by 3 that is considered first equation okay and uh, what is actually this is d y n upon d that is uh, path difference what is path difference that is s2 p minus s1 p is equal to d y n upon capital D and this value is lambda by 3 and this path difference denoted by delta means delta is equal to y by 3. Is it okay? Now as we know that phase difference phase difference phi is equal to k into path difference. Here k means 2 pi by lambda and what is path difference that is lambda by 3. So here lambda lambda cancel out then phase difference is equal to 2 pi by 3. So here we get phase difference 2 pi by 3. Okay. Now in the question here given the central fringe is I naught and here at the point P, the intensity that is I, okay. So here, the relation between the intensity at the point P, that is I equal to I naught cos square phi, okay. Here phi, that is the phase difference. And what is the phase difference? That is 2 pi by 3. So here cos 2 pi by 3 whole square. And what is 2 pi by 3? 2 pi by 3 means 120. Okay. Here 2 into 180 by 3. So that is 120. And 120, what is the value of cos 120? minus 1 by 2 whole square. 
So here I not and 1 by 2 square that is 1 by 4, 1 by 4. So here I equal to I naught by 4 that we have to prove. Okay. I think so. You understood this question. Thank you. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely when you will become success, full contribution goes to your hard work. But if my videos, my lectures, my questions will help in your success, I will consider myself lucky. Please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye-bye.